So we got J. Cole and we got YB. If you haven't hit that notification bell or that like button, make sure that you do if you enjoy the content. So the, for the people who don't know the situation, basically YB ended up making a song. And um, it's called like F the Industry. He ended up speaking about a lot of rappers in the song. He ended up, you know, speaking on Drake. He ended up speaking on Lil Durk. He ended up, you know, speaking on J. Cole, Lil Yachty. But to be honest, a lot of people were surprised when J. Cole's name was dropped in YB's song. They feel like J. Cole don't have nothing to do with a lot of stuff that happens in the industry. So they feel like it was surprising, you know, thing to actually mention his name and a lot of people that don't know about the situation may feel like that was the first time that yb and j cole kind of interacted but academics end up explaining in a situation where basically you know j cole was waiting in the studio for yb for a couple hours and yb end up explaining that he wasn't in the greatest mood so he didn't want that you know to spill on the track so that was you know a kind of crazy situation i don't know if you know j cole felt some type of way you know after that but people feel like he ended up responding on this new song with lil yachty and the crazy thing about it they both was mentioned in on uh, YB song. Play the cold, I gonna do it. So I take this line of muscle sign. I swear it's gonna be nice to meet you. Nigga threats and I laugh, that's cause you ain't a threat The incoming car, press the button, the one that say accept He FaceTime to ask for a feature and saw the face of death. I'm on your song, your streams going up, not quite the Drake effect. Now the part when J. Cole end up saying that, you know, I'm on your songs and your streams going up, that's what made me kind of think he wasn't talking about YB because I don't even think he have a song with YB and that, you know, situation don't really apply to him. But to also add to it, J. Cole manager end up responding. That's how you know this situation is, you know, kind of getting out of hand. A lot of people end up posting it and basically saying that he end up responding to YB. And I understand it because of the part of the uh, FaceTime, he called him and he end up, you know, speaking to other rappers saying they threatening him. Basically, YB said he sent him the mustard sign and said, be nice to meet you so that's kind of a threat and then um also saying he wanted a feature and that was what the whole situation is about but the only thing that kind of threw me off is when he ended up saying he was on his songs and his streams went up but y'all let me know in the comment section if you think that he was actually responding to him make sure you guys like comment subscribe hit that notification button i'll see you in the next video